Welcome my friends to this 10 minute workout to help improve your balance or day three of the 10 day challenge. So if you're joining me on that, well done for being here. All you're going to need for today is a nice safe and flat space for your mat. You might wanna be nearby to a wall or a chair to help catch you if you have any wobbles. But apart from that, you know your body best. Take breaks and modify whenever you need. So when you're ready, let's get moving. All right, so starting down on our mats will be on all fours. We have six exercises today. We'll be going for 30 seconds each exercise. So joining me when you're ready on all fours. And we're going to begin now in two, one. Just start by extending the legs back first, finding your balance here, palm spread. And then just the option to start adding opposite arm to leg. And I want you to see if you can find that little pause as you extend out and on the other side. So just continuing here, belly lightly drawing back to spine, lengthen through the crown of the head. Three, two, one, coming up to standing. We're gonna be moving, taking a little step to the side and catching our balance as we draw up the opposite knee. So you can start by just taking smaller steps and then maybe bigger steps. And maybe that turns into a bit of a bound but I really want you to catch that balance on each side. Beautiful. Awesome, so from here, hands on hips, lifting up that right leg, and we're just gonna balance here, keeping the leg and the thigh lifted, softening the shoulders. To add on here, we can start to take the gaze from side to side or you might start to extend the arms out, point the fingers, look up to the sky in the center, and then over to the other side. Beautiful, so drawing up through that supporting leg. We'll take that to the other side. So lifting left leg, option one, option two, taking the gaze from side to side. Option three, adding those arms in. Beautiful, so holding strong through the core. And from here, we're gonna to come to our tippy bird. So from here, hands to hips or to the heart, starting to rock forward and stand up and come to the other side. So long, extending out through that back heel. Beautiful soft knee on that supporting leg. And see if you can really control the full range of the movement, lightly swapping onto the other foot. And last one, hands to hips, starting to lift up little calf raises. Now noticing if you're starting to kind of collapse outwards with the ankles, can we keep inner and outer weight so even weight to the inner and the outer edge of the foot. Beautiful, and at the top, we might start to pulse halfway down and up to the top. Four, three, two, one. Well done, that's the first round done. So we're gonna be coming back down onto the mat on all fours. So taking a little break here. So this is a nice, I guess, kind of change of pace if you have been following along on the 10 day challenge. But really important that we are working on our balance, especially as we get older, to avoid falls, to keep the body strong. So well done joining me, coming back to all fours. We start to extend the legs back one at a time. And again, we had that option with the arm. And if you'd like to add on even further, we can tuck the toes. Extend one leg back at a time. The knees are hovering. You can see if you can add the arm on here as well. So that's really quite challenging, that one. So continuing with ever option you're on. Well done, coming up to standing. We're taking our little steps side to side or our big bounds. Now to add on here, if you like, we find the balance extend the leg, draw it back in. Find the balance, extend the leg, draw it back in. Beautiful. 
Eight more seconds here. Last one. Now let's come to our balance right leg lifts. Choosing whichever option. Drawing the belly in, lifting up through the supporting leg. Maybe adding those arms for a challenge. And if you're on option one, just choosing one spot to focus the gaze on. That can help with the balance as well. And to the other side. Well done, don't forget to smile. <laughs> and after this, we're moving into our tippy bird. Awesome, so hands to hips or heart, starting to tip forward and stand. Forward and stand. Well done. So can we imagine like we're keeping the top of the head down to the heel in one straight line. So we've practiced catching ourselves from side to side. Now we practice catching ourselves forward and back. And last one, calf raises, lift and lower. Lift and lower, well done. Find that pause and lower. Everything draws up, lower. Well done. Option to add that little pulse, stay halfway down, straight back up, halfway down. Well done. This is the end of the second round, so we're nearly there. Thighs drawing up. And lower, shake it out. We'll be coming back down onto the mat. Again, to our all fours position, extending the legs and the arms out. So take a breath, have a little stretch. moving towards that final round. So if you wanted to try a different option, feel free, just have a go. When you're ready, joining me and let's move. Extending back, perhaps adding that arm, perhaps trying out the hover, perhaps adding the arm as well. So wherever you are, just making sure you're breathing, that you're moving nice and slow. In a moment, we're standing up. Beautiful. Big or little step to the side, option to add that leg extension. And maybe each time, you see if you can get a little further over and catch the balance. Oop. Well done. About five more seconds here. All right, lifting the right leg, hands to hips, choosing your option here. And keeping that right leg lifted, notice if it's starting to lower at all. Keeping the left leg drawing up. Ball of the foot grounded to the other side. Again, choosing that gaze point for the eyes, focusing here. And then see if you can take the internal focus onto the breath, into the body. Coming to our tippy bird, hands to heart, off we go. Keeping the hips and the shoulders facing straight forward. Body one straight line. Little micro bend in that supporting leg. Again, 
breathing, trying not to hold the breath. Movement slow and controlled. Last one, coming into calf raises. Lift and lower. Here we think of going straight up, straight down. Up and press heels forward, lower. Option now to start adding that pulse halfway down. Ooh. Again, trying not to let those ankles collapse out if you can. Three, two, one. Give it a nice shake out. Well done. Shake out through the hands. Just take the arms by the side. Let's take three breaths here. And two. And three. And thank you so much for joining me today. If you're on the challenge, I'll see you tomorrow for day four. If not, I'll see you again soon. Bye-bye.